Fantastic. Um, I know on behalf of the players, we'd like to thank everyone that supported us uh, during uh, and today and uh, made it such a special occasion. Uh, we hope we've uh, put a smile on everyone's face and uh, we couldn't have done it with all these people behind us. We're really absolutely uh, proud to be playing for the football club. And to each and every one of these boys, it was a phenomenal performance last week, wasn't it? Deserved winners. You must be so proud of them. And of course, all of your staff who put in so many hours behind the scenes. <laughs> um, yeah, I think uh, that we're, we're all getting applauded, but these boys, you know, every one of them to a man, were absolutely fantastic last weekend. Um, so, you know, they should be extremely proud of what they've done for the football club uh, and for the town of Bromley. Uh, me personally, I'd like to thank my staff. Um, they've worked tirelessly. I think uh, the players would agree that they've put so much uh, time and effort to make sure we was ready and prepared to get the result that this, uh, this town needed and, and deserved. because I believe this is a springboard. This is a springboard for the next piece of history we're going to make. And on that bit of history, 97 minutes were played in that football match. Probably a couple more minutes, but, but it was recorded as 97 minutes. celebrating a jewel in our crown that we really should celebrate more often. Not only did the juniors, I believe, under 14s and under 16s, and our wonderful ladies, and the gents won. We are so proud of Bromley, aren't we? So proud of them. the roads, you cheered them up the mile and now we're going to hand over to allow others to have a lovely chat with you and tell you how they feel about how proud we are of Bromley. Please remember hashtag proud of Bromley. Put all your photos up there because we are really proud to be Bromley. I'm going to hand over now and I'll speak to you later. <laughs> Yeah,